What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome back to the Beastly Gamer channel. Today we're going to talk about a rumor that is possible, but mm, probably not probable, about Sony's upcoming Sony event on September 7th. Now we all know on September 7th at this PlayStation event, uh, more than likely, a 99% probability that we're going to see the PlayStation 4K or the PlayStation Neo. I'm probably going to find out what this thing is actually really called, if it has any difference in the way that it's designed, is it slim, is it going to be able to compete with the Xbox Scorpio, all these questions will more than likely be answered on that day. Now, new news about this event has come to surface, and it's got people speculating on whether or not Sony's handheld division is actually truly dead. And we're talking about the PlayStation Vita. PlayStation Vita has not sold very well, uh, it, for, for the most part. It is dead. Uh, the only exciting thing that's happened with the Vita in recent news is it being hacked uh, and given the Hinkaku exploit, which allows you to put home brews and everything on your Vita. Other than that, the Vita hasn't been really an exciting place to play for a while. But this could be exciting news, especially if it's true. I'll drop a link in the description. Is Sony about to unveil a new PlayStation Vita? Sony will be holding a special press event in New York on September 7th. The company didn't specify what this event is for, but we can be reasonably sure that it will unveil its next PlayStation 4, dubbed the PS4 Neo. This news would be enough to justify an event. But if a recent rumor is true, then it is possible that Sony will also be announcing an upgraded version of its current handheld device, the PlayStation Vita. A Japanese blog found an FCC listing that had patents for two new wireless chips. One chip had the model name AWCB262, this is similar to the PlayStation 4 line of hardware and could be for the PlayStation 4 Neo. The other chip had a model name of JH0H091. This one is similar to that of the PlayStation Vita line of hardware. Due to this similarity, some think that Sony will update the Vita. The NeoGAF user who started the thread about the rumor has dubbed this the PlayStation Vita Trinity, mocking the Matrix sounding names of the PlayStation VR and PS4K, the Neo. Adding legitimacy to the rumor is a letter of short-term confidentiality that Sony sent to the FCC. The letter states that external photos, internal photos, test set of photos, and user manuals are to be kept confidential for 180 days from the date of equipment authorization. Could Sony be working on an upgraded PlayStation Vita? Perhaps not. As some in the NeoGAF thread have noted, the chip model name is also similar to that of the current PS4 chip. Sony has already stated that it plans to unveil a PS4 Slim at the Tokyo Game Show, so it is possible that the new chip is for that revised console. However, since the PS4 is getting an upgrade, Sony may be looking to also update its PS Vita in order for it to have functionality with the PlayStation 4 Neo. As always, take this rumor with a proverbial grain of salt. The PS Vita wasn't exactly a popular machine, so it seems odd that Sony would try to revise it. Stranger things have happened, though. Uh, so. Guys, this is what I think, all right? It all depends on if you're a half, a cup half full or a cup half empty kind of guy. Sony has had two handhelds in the history of PlayStation. The PSP, PlayStation Portable, which had many iterations, the Slim, the PSP Go. Uh, and, and these consoles saw major, major success. Uh, a lot of it had to do with the fact that it was easily moddable in the later years of the PSP, but I bought the PSP as soon as it came out. Uh, the Vita, I bought that the, the day it came out. I actually got it before anybody else. I, I was one of the early adopters of the, the PlayStation Vita. And it didn't see nearly the success of the PSP. So in my opinion, Sony uh, has had real success and pretty, pretty real failure uh, in the handheld market. They've had more success than failure. They've tried twice. One was a monumental success and one was an epic blunder with the Vita. What does that mean? It means that Sony still could come back and try this again. Uh, they, their number one way of making money in Sony is through their, their video games. And for us to think that Sony believes that the handheld market is dead is, I think, premature. I think the handheld market is moving towards mobile. And who knows if Sony is going to plan to go that way with their next handheld. I do believe at some point in time in the future, Sony will have another handheld because it's just what they do. They create these things. They make games for them and people buy them. And sometimes they buy more than others. So whether or not this rumor is true that we'll see a new Vita or anything as far as a handheld at this new Sony event, who knows? Probably not. 
but I honestly do believe that at some point in time in the future, Sony will release a new handheld. You guys, let me know what you think. Is this possible? Do you guys think it's totally dead? Do you think Sony is completely out of the handheld market? Or do you think that we will at some point in time see a new handheld from PlayStation in the future? Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, give a thumbs up, show support for the channel, follow me on Facebook and Twitter, and tell all your friends about me. I'm the Beastly Gamer, and I'll see you guys next time. Let it go.